Hi, this is Lydia with Rescue42. Today I'm going to be reviewing the features and functions of the Telecrib strut jack. Occasionally, when doing a vehicle or a home stabilization, you'll find yourself needing to do a lifting operation. By attaching one of our Telecrib strut jacks to one of our Telecrib struts, you'll make a very powerful lifting tool. To attach your Telecrib strut jack to a strut, simply lift it onto the base plate ears Adjust the lifting head so that it fits on the strut, and then insert your pins. The strut jack has three pins. The ball detent pin gives you gross adjustment to allow the strut jack to be used with both short and long struts. The safety hitch pin ensures that the strut jack isn't going to hop off the strut in the event of a load shift. And the steel pin attaches the head of the jack to the strut. Once the pins are in place, give the jack handle one turn to remove the pressure off of the yellow pin. Then remove the pin and start your lift. You have up to 15 inches of lift at a time with your jack. If you need more of an ascent, go ahead and repin your strut sections. You can bring the jack back down to the collapsed position and begin to lift again. In certain lifting operations, such as machinery rescue, you may want to replace the base plate with a spike foot for a more positive grip. Simply remove the base plate, then attach the jack, and use a base pin to attach the jack onto the strut. By attaching the Telecrib strut jack, your struts become a 4,000 pound lifting tool with a two to one safety factor. Now the struts can be used singly or in pairs to do lifting operations on their own or to crib behind airbag operations. Be sure to watch chapter 14 of our instructional video for more information. Be sure to visit our website at www.rescue42.com. And if you have questions about our rescue equipment or about stabilization techniques, give us a call at 888-427-3728. Thanks for watching and stay safe.